With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Today our question is angle between x is equal to 2 and x minus 3y is equal to 6 is. Right, so the given equations are x is equal to 2 and x minus 3y is equal to 6. We know that to find angle between two lines, we have a formula tan theta is equal to m2 minus m1 upon 1 plus m1 m2. Right, where m1 m2 terms are the slopes of the equations of line. Now, uh, multiplying by tan inverse on both sides, we will get tan inverse of tan theta is equal to tan inverse of m2 minus m1 upon 1 plus m1 m2 right and this will give us the formula for theta right tan th uh, theta is equal to tan inverse of m2 minus m1 upon 1 plus m1 m2 now if theta is equals to 0 then the lines are parallel right for theta is equals to 0 line l1 l2 are parallel and for theta is equals to 90 degree l1 is perpendicular to l2 right the m1 m2 terms are the slopes of the equation of line now we consider the general equation of a straight line which is y is equals to mx plus c and consider the given equation x is equals to t and compare it with the uh, with the general of general equation right so if we compare it with this equation we can see that there is no slope right there is no uh, slope and there is no intercept as well because this is due to the fact that there is no y term in this equation since x is equal to 2 is a line which is perpendicular to x axis this will be like this right x is equal to 2 is a line that is perpendicular to x axis and there will be no y term so we can say that there is no slope right so when there is no slope of for the first line so we can say that this formula will not be valid because to find theta using this formula we need two slopes uh, we need slopes of both the lines but for, but here we have slope of only one line and not the second line right so we will have the slope of the second equation which is equals to x minus 3y is equals to 6 let me cross check it x minus 3y is equals to 6 right so comparing it with the general equation we will get minus 3y is equals to 6 minus x or we can say 3y is equals to x minus 6 and this can be written as y is equals to x upon 3 minus 6 upon 3 x upon 3 minus 2 so this is what the second equation and after comparing with the general equation of line we can see that the slope is 1 upon 3 here right m is 1 upon 3 and we know that m is equals to tan theta tan theta is 1 upon 3 m is 1 upon 3 so we can say that theta will be equals to tangent inverse of 1 upon 3 so the second uh, line slope is 1 upon 3 we know that this theta is the angle made with the x axis with the x axis and this line right so now we will make the coordinate axis and see the diagram of this question right so here our uh, we have a line that is x is equals to 2 let's say this is our line which is x is equals to 2 and the second line is x minus 3y is equal to c 6 right if we put x is equal to 0 here we can see that our y will be minus 2 and if we put x is equals to 3 here for x is equals to 3 we will get 3 minus 3y is equal to 6 that is 3 minus 6 minus 3 minus 3 upon 3 that is y is equals to minus 1 so our points one point is 0 minus 2 and the another point is 3 comma minus 1 so we will plot it here 0 0 will be here and minus 2 will be right here right and the second point is 3 comma minus 1 so 3 positive x axis minus 1 so somewhere right here right now we will join them and we can see that Yes, this is the line after joining right now we can see that we have got our theta that is equal to tan inverse of 1 upon 3 and we know that this theta is with the is the angle between the x-axis positive x-axis and the line so this is our line 
right this is our positive x axis so the theta that we have just got tan inverse of 1 upon 3 is this theta right tan inverse of 1 upon 3 and in the question we have asked to find out the angle between these two lines x is equals to 2 and the another line is x minus 3y is equals to 6 this is 90 degree angle and this is theta right that is we have to find out so we have this angle only so here we will use the concept of a triangle which states that sum of all interior angles is equal to 180 degree therefore we get this is 90 this is theta 90 plus theta plus let's say this is your x and we have to find this angle so we will take this angle as x and this as theta right since these are vertically opposite angles so uh, this theta will also equal to tan inverse of 1 by 3 so we will write here using triangle property 90 plus theta plus x will gives you 180 degree right and as we know theta is equals to tan inverse of 1 upon 3 so we will write here theta is tan inverse of 1 by 3 plus x is equals to 180 minus 90 it will gives you 90 x will be equal to 90 minus tan inverse of 1 by 3 right and we know that uh, 90 is, can be written as pi by 2 so we will write pi by 2 minus tan inverse of 1 upon 3 this is what your x now we have a identity that says cot inverse theta plus tan inverse theta is equals to pi by 2 right cot inverse theta plus tan inverse theta is equals to pi by 2 right so we will use this identity in this equation we can see that cot inverse theta is pi by 2 minus tan inverse theta so we can write here x is equals to cot inverse of theta that is cot inverse of x now multiplying by cot on both sides we will get cot x is equals to 1 upon 3 and we know uh, that slope is equals to tan theta right so we have to find this x in form of tan so we know that cot x is equals to 1 upon tan x which is equals to 1 upon 3 and since and so we will get tan x is equals to 3 from here and we had to find x so x is multiplying by tan inverse on both sides will give us x is equals to tan inverse of 3 so that is what the actual angle between the lines x is equals to 2 and x is equals to and x minus 3y is equals to 6 so that is the correct op option will be your option 2 right and one thing to note here is that as we are here given to find the angle between the two lines right so one can mistake while drawing the angles by watching the diagram we can clear the confusion just need to remember here that since there is a topic about slope then it will be made with x-axis right it will be made with x-axis and then we will find the angle between the given lines if this point is not maintained then answer will not be correct at all so one can be confused by reading the line to find the angle between the two lines right so you may use this formula here but because uh, since because we don't have the slope of the first line so we cannot use this formula and this formula will become invalid here so our final answer is tan inverse of 3 thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today